afternoon is please. Oh, hiya. Um, can I get a bit of advice, please? With regards to... Um, coercive and controlling behaviour. Hold on for me. Thank you. Oh, hi, Essex Place. How are you? Well, good, thank you. How are you? Yeah, not bad, not bad. I've been made aware of a um, a case where um, there's basically uh, it's it's a um, a divorced uh, couple, a bloke and a, a lady, and they've got two children. The mother is stating to the father that um, unless she gives him a couple of hundred quid, she's going to report her children as having COVID symptoms and not allow him to see them over Christmas. Is that coercive and controlling behaviour? Um, can I ask who you are, please? Um, I don't want to give my name at this time because I've not been authorised to actually discuss the case with anyone. OK. Um, right, the answer to that is I'm not too sure. So if you bear with me, I'm just going to ask somebody else that's in the room, OK? So just bear with me. Thank you. Even though they should know, it's nice that they say they don't know and they check because there's nothing worse than wrong information. Might pause this. Um, yeah, oh, yeah, sort advice, and um, the um, opinion is that yes, it is. So it w- would go down as a domestic incident. Great, great. Um, just get them to, to try and encourage them to report it. Absolutely. Yeah, because yeah. the, the the thing is, the uh, the gentleman's already um, spoken to, I believe, the courts about it because obviously it's been through the family court, and the family court right. have advised him to put in an application, which is just under the amount of money that the mother's demanding um, and told him that there's no guarantee it will be heard before Christmas, which would completely defeat the the whole object. Um, I'm just a little bit shocked that the family court doesn't recognise coercive and controlling behaviour. You know, Serious Crime Act 2015, um, you know, and uh, I just wondered if I've missed a trick. Um, Thanks ever so much for your time. Thank you for uh, finding the information out rather than just giving me the wrong information or information you was uncertain of. And um, I'll do my best to um, get him to report that one. Thank you very okay, much. All right. Thank you. Thank bye. you. Bye. So there you go, guys. Um, what's happened is basically the mum has said that she's going to report that the whole family are um, experiencing COVID symptoms so that she doesn't have to send her children to the dad at Christmas unless he gives her a few hundred quid. Uh Threatening to not see your children is coercive and controlling behaviour, a criminal offence.